Bishop Ted, mga minamahal na kapatid na pari, sigurado ko hong mahaba-habang kwentuhan mamaya sa tanghalian, kaya doon ko na lang ikukwento kung bakit ako naririto para sundan yung gawain ni Monsignor Vengo. Sa pagkakataong pong ito sa misa natin, nais kong balikan ng isang tanong nung tayo ay nag-aaral pa sa seminaryo. Tanong ng bata. Tanong ng isang kabataan. Tanong ng isang teenager. At ito ay inulit pa ni Pope Francis sa kanyang sulat sa mga kabataan. Ang paboritong tanong ay, Who are you? Who am I? Who are you? Who am I? Minsan sasagot tayo ng ating pangalan. Pero kapag inulit, But who really are you? That question we answered when we were in the seminary. But that question remains relevant even if we are active in ministry or elderly in ministry. That question is still important for us, my dear fathers. Who are you? I will give you wrong answers first. The first wrong answer is, I am not my money. Do not identify yourself with your wealth, with your money, because money does not give us identity. Not houses, not cars, not money, not stocks, not bonds. These do not give us identity. Second, I am not my work. Hindi ako ang aking gawain. Hindi ako ang aking trabaho. Hindi ako ang aking destino. Hindi, hindi ako ang aking assignment bilang pare. Mawala o dumating ang assignment, mabago o mawala ang destino, alam ko mayroon pa akong pagkatao na hindi ibinibigay sa akin ng aking gawain. I am not my money. I am not my work. Third, I am not what other people say. No matter what people say, I am not that. Hindi ko nakikilala ang aking sarili sa pamamagitan ng pagiging sikat o kaya ay sa pamamagitan ng pagiging nakalimutan. Hindi ko nakikita ang aking pagkatao sa aking pagiging laos o kaya ay pagiging sikat at tanyag. What other people say, our popularity does not give us identity. Fourth, dear fathers, I am not my mistakes. I am not my sins. Because there is something greater than my mistakes. And mistakes do not give us identity. Sometimes we can be so unkind to ourselves that we identify ourselves with the mistakes of the past, mistakes of human weakness. But we are not our mistakes. Fifth, I am not my success. Because every success is temporary. The Miss Universe this year will not be Miss Universe next year. The popular today will be vapor tomorrow. The powerful today will be vanity tomorrow. I am not my money. I am not my work. I am not what other people say. I am not my mistakes. I am not my success. So back to the teenage question, which is also an elderly question. But who am I? There is something more important than the question, who am I? And that something more important is the question, Whose 
am I? Para kanino ako? To whom do I belong? And then we answer, I belong to God. And it is in belonging to God that we know who we are. Ibig sabihin po, we will not be able to know ourselves unless we see ourselves as belonging to God. The Basilica of Santa Maria Maggiore does not have its identity. It is only such because it is the temple of God. It belongs to God. You, my dear fathers, are like that Basilica. You are great. You are awesome. You are heroic. But you have no identity. I have no identity. We have no identity unless we declare, I belong to God. I close with a familiar story. I am sure you have heard, but it is worthwhile retelling that when Teresa de Jesus was having severe crisis and darkness in her life, coming down from her cloister, she saw a little boy in the convent playing and she said we are not an orphanage why do you have a boy inside the convent so with a smile sister teresa in her crisis in her darkness in her frustrations disappointments and confusions smiled at the boy and said to the boy good morning my name is teresa de jesus what is your name? And the little boy answered, Good morning. My name is Jesus de Teresa. It was the child Jesus who appeared to Teresa to console her and to tell her, You belong to me. I belong to you. My name is Villegas. And we have different family names. But the reality is, all of us have the same family name. And our common family name is of Jesus, De Jesus. And from that De Jesus, we know who we really are. No matter what money, no matter what work, no matter what people say, no matter what mistakes we have done, no matter the achievements we have reached, I am only of Jesus, and that is how I know who I am. I belong to Him.